Yes, the S650 photos have been released. How real are they? I don't know, but let's check it out. What's happening everybody is your boy Ken Oshan with the world famous do, 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 do. You know you want to say it Blue Oval Media and I literally got this stuff It's fresh off the press. It's hot off the press I just found these photos and it's that new S650 the 2024 S650 these are Supposed to be the real photos of the new Mustang. They have been leaked and so Let's talk about it because tonight Ford is supposed to reveal it, but that's not until eight o'clock. So let's release this now and let's talk about it. So the first thing I want to talk about is the exterior and the body of this car. I am going to be very honest with you all. As a S550 fan, I really love this new redesign of this S650. If this is really it, this thing looks gorgeous. I mean, they really modernized this thing. They really made this thing look amazing. The exterior, the headlights, everything about it is pretty darn clean. And one of the things that I think that we need to take into consideration is that I don't feel like Ford has ever let me down as it relates to this Mustang. And this is just 2024 just written all over it. I love it. Number two, this interior. Now, based off of what I see on this interior, it looks like this is a continuous dash that goes into where the ready. I mean, this is a big screen. And I know that makes some of you all mad because you still like cassette players. But I mean, this thing has a huge, huge screen and it's all digital. Yes, it's 2024, you all. It has to be digital. It looks clean. It looks modern. This is what we're using. You have an 80 inch TV screen in your home, but you want a cassette player in your car. Let that go. It's not going to happen. They did a great job with that. What, what I'm seeing with this screen and the instrument panel and cluster. I believe that this thing is 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 next level. It it has me wanting to go to the dealership now and place my order, even though I don't need to be buying no more cars. Now, based off of this photo that we're looking at right here, these are Recaro seats. And man, they just look like they're very comfortable. Next level, got the, the two-tone thing going on. It looks looks very, very sleek. Like I said, it's just very modern and I really love to see this modern style look and what they're doing with that. Then when you look at this photo with all three versions, I mean, you're, they're kind of like giving you the, this is the GT, this is the convertible, this is what maybe the, I don't know if it's four cylinder, six cylinder, whatever, EcoBoost, whatever it's gonna be, version is, is like, is, we're giving you that along with the fact that you know we're showing you this front end is monstrous it is nasty it is in your face like yes i I'm, i need all the air i can get because i'm going fast i love it especially with all the competitors and all the competitors not being able to keep up i feel like ford is making sure no we're gonna keep the mustang and the mustang legend going and we're gonna keep this thing moving but like i said i don't like these these photos are leaked so Let's take all of that into consideration. And then the back end. I know I kind of showed you all in a previous video on the back end. I was a little concerned with the render that I saw. This one right here. I'm going to be honest. I'm not disappointed at all. I, 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 I don't know what else to say. I'm not disappointed at all. I feel like Ford has done an amazing job with this back end. And it really just takes the S550 look to just a whole nother level and we're about to see a whole nother generation of mustang enthusiasts and owners that are going to come to like these cars along with some of us that already have been liking these cars i just think that this is just next level and they just did a great job and so um man if this is really it shout out to ford like i said they're gonna do the reveal tonight and it'll be a major announcement tonight but if these are it shout out to so my question to you all is now that you have seen this and if these are really it, would you consider now getting an S650? I wonder if they're going to have enough production 
for everybody that wants to buy it. I'm going to be real honest with you. It's very hard for me to not consider it. You know, I've been kind of talking to you all about maybe possibly building some content around it. And now that I see it, it's very, very hard to not consider it. But then, like I said, Ford will be doing a reveal from Detroit on tonight. I believe they're doing that at eight o'clock. So I don't know how relevant this video will be, but I wanted to put it out here in advance so that you all can see it as as I saw it. <laughs> Like I said, these just hit the just hit online and, and I just found them. And so don't know if they don't take my word for it just yet. We'll know at eight o'clock and then we'll come back and talk about it again. But like I said, if this is really it, I am excited about the S650. I almost want to say, hey, put my order in now, but I don't want to be divorced. So I let me ask the wife before I start talking all that talk. Yeah. So do me a favor, if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe, hit the notification bell so that you can know when all of the new Ford news is coming up, all of the new Mustang news is coming up. It's your boy Ken Sean with the world famous Blue Oval Media, and I am out.